Hi again and welcome to aquaheat.org.uk, my name's Steve and today I'm going to look at how to fill up a heating system on a Worcester Bosch boiler, Worcester Boss um, Junior or the SI models the, and the CDIs are all the same, how you fill them up. Got an internal filling link on the boiler, so first of all this needle here is your pressure gauge, tells you what the pressure reading is of the boiler. If you found that at zero, that means you need to put pressure in the system means like it's running empty. And to do that, it's quite simple. First of all, close that. On this one, you've got a lid underneath. You take off. Some of them that have been installed, there is no lid underneath. We've just got left the key in there, because a lot of people lose, lose the uh, key. So this is our key, it comes out of that tray. And it pops up into this black housing. On this black housing, you've got a symbol of an unpadlock padlock and a padlock padlock. You can just about see that. And then you push that key up into the unpadlock position and you turn it to the right, locking it in position to the locks padlock symbol. Once it's in there, then make sure the heating's off at the time. You would just open this nut, you can see that. Just turn that anti clockwise. You can hear that water going, hear that noise. It's water going in. You see that black needle rise, when it rises to 1, 1.5. I'm going to top that needle up a bit. Yeah, it's just risen a teeny bit and then I'm going to close that again. Close that again, just hand tight. That's it. Turn that up. Now, I can leave that key in or I can take it out. Now on this one we're going to take it out. So just move that out of the way so you get a little drip of water coming down. So just turn that, make sure it's closed. Turn that back to the unpadlock symbol. Pull down. Give it a shake, away you go, and uh, you put it back in position here, and then this one goes in like so, nice and simple. So that is how you top up a centre Worcester Bosch boiler with the internal filling link. So if you like information on this or any other installation that we do, then uh, drop us an email to info at aquaheat.org.uk. Thanks very much.